up, Bass Babes? It's your girl, Joy, back with another bingo. How you doing? How you doing? How are you? How are you? Okay. I never showed y'all my nails. I'm not that crazy about them. They're cute. The little sunflower thing. They're okay. So maybe in another week or two, I'll get them cut down shorter, much, much shorter. And I don't know, maybe I go back to my regular honey. Cause when you start adding designs and stuff, that price be going up. Mm -mm. I don't got nobody to take care of my nails anymore, honey. So uh, I may go back to the basics, honey. So anyway, how y'all doing? Mm -hmm, you good, you good. So I just made it to the library. I feel as though I'm running behind. And it is 12.30. I don't know if today is Thursday or Friday. It's Thursday, child. I, I've, I've lost track of days. I don't know anymore. I stopped in a Sprint store to ask them a question. Girl's like, you look like boho chic. Boho, you, I just like, I like the vibe. I was like, baby, I'm a whole mood, okay? I'm going to the library. Do I need to be basic? And y'all wouldn't expect anything less than being extra. Who gonna check me, boo? nobody why well, you can't play dress up and i got on sweatpants first i had on some little platforms i took those off and i put my little sneaker heels on okay so listen 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 so i've been thinking y'all <clears throat> i am i feel this stress anxiety not stress it's an anxiety well i guess it's from the stress building in my chest because there's so much swimming around in my head and I haven't sat down to sort it all out. Does that make sense? So my little rolly suitcase is packed to the rim, child, with books and papers, ideas, and I guess that's just the life of being a teacher, you know, who's really in for it. Some teachers enjoy their summer breaks and, and that's totally fine. But me, I take a couple of weeks I don't know it feels like when I'm doing nothing or if I'm taking a break I feel a little guilty I do that is the strangest thing so I just want to map everything out well I probably won't get much done so my goal is to be here about six or seven hours um I went to the doctor just to check my blood levels because I started craving ice again and honey iron is low 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 so i need to get another iron infusion but let me tell you this may be tmi this may be tmi but you know where i'm with the low iron and low blood it comes from some type of bleeding in, within the body okay and we know what my problem is but baby i didn't have anything in june baby here it is july come on come on come on Cut it off, cut it off, cut it off. I'm done, I'm ready for it to be over, over. So nothing in June, let's see what happens in July. I'll, baby, because the excessive bleeding, it is horrific, it is like, oh my God. Talking about bad, bad, bad. Enough about that, I'm trying to give y'all a little bit of everything, okay? And, oh yeah, okay, this is it, this is it. Listen, 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 oh, make sure you click the, the thumbs up button. Click like, click like, click like, or not, but go ahead and click it anyway, cause I said so, okay? Click like and click share, click click like and share, share, okay? So listen, 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 calm down, calm down, we'll get to it. But baby, the other part, I've just been so excited. Oh, look at that van, okay. I know they living in that one, yo. Mm-hmm. Wonder what kind of van that is. That's a big baby. I know she probably cute inside. Oh, okay. Oh, sorry. I just saw a van go by, which brings me to my topic, honey. But baby, I've been watching so many videos and build outs and this and that. And I'm gonna do it, y'all. This is my last time signing a lease. I've really been thinking about it, thinking about it. I am doing it. I don't know if I could wait to Thanksgiving because I want to wait for Thanksgiving and just start to downsize. And I've been thinking, see, my brain is just all over the place. You, you don't understand. Okay, so over the next 12 months, it's about getting my credit in order, getting my credit in order. So these are my goals. Oh, I'm gonna write down my goals. My my first month, my three month goal, my five month goal. My one month goal before school starts is to enroll in grad school. And I can take a class or two a semester and that'll 
postpone my student loans, okay? Because <laughs> I've been a postponing fool. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. So anyway, and that'll take that pressure off. And then I want to move into other things in the future. So instead of just being a teacher, which I enjoy, I've been told I can help more students by helping teachers grow and teaching them, you know, different ways. So with this new learning and teaching way that I'm going to be implementing next month. Oh my God, y'all, I go to school next month, next month. I don't know, it just feels like school gives me purpose because it's like, it's what I'm supposed to be doing. Does that make sense? Does that make sense? Leave it in the comment section below. Or am I crazy? I don't know. I could be wrong. I, but that's how I feel. So when I'm not in school, you know, it's a time to rejuvenate, but I feel as though... I need to be with my students, even the ones that be working these nerves, bro. They work these nerves. Woo! <laughs> but anyway, listen, listen, listen. I'm all over the place and I do take medication. I don't know. Sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't, okay? So listen, so I'm going to set these goals and hold me accountable. So my first one for the first month from now until August, let's just say August 9th because the kids come August 9th. So I need to have my butt enrolled in school. I did email a couple of places. And when you want to email some of those online schools, the child ain't been calling you 99,000 times a day. Calm down. Let me think about this. Wrap my brain around this. Okay? Hold on. Hold on. The other thing is pull my credit report. It's not a lot on there. But when I lost my house, I had an attorney. My attorney is over. It's done. So don't say what you should have done. It, it's done. So the attorney um, suggested and encouraged me to file a bankruptcy to try to save the house. And to no avail, that did not work. So I had that blemish on my credit, but that ain't stopping no show. It is what it is, okay? So I've had that on my credit for about three years. But, you know, once you do that, you can start to build, okay? There is life after bankruptcy, period. So anyway, listen, listen, listen. So I ain't worried about that anyway. So... Um, pull that, see what little knickknacks are on there, knickknack, patty, whack, okay? And start to rebuild, okay? So I have that. Of course, I'm learning this new way of teaching. I'm going to be implementing that when school starts. So I say I was going to start the downsize. I'm serious now, y'all. Serious, serious as a heart attack. But there are certain things like my bed, like the desk in my room. I might save the TV, like the stand that the TV's on. I might let that go. I, I do want to save my bed. I spent the pretty money on a bed. Because I don't know what, what is going to happen in life. I don't know what life is going to bring. So I do want to save my bed. The kids' bed, the girls' bed, bye. Everything in that room, bye, bye, bye. Their stuff gone, bye. Bed gone, none. The other room is empty. I just got my, my camera stuff in there. I'm trying to create a little studio, okay? The living room is just a sofa and the toy chest that the kids, it's a toy chest that I made into a coffee table because I've had that since the kids were babies. So it kind of holds some type of sentimental value. So I probably saved that. The end tables, I got those from a thrift store. So, I, bye, bye, bye. And I do have a, a little dresser thing. It's beautiful. Someone um, gifted that to me when I was going through another transition in life. And they, they made that. So, I will keep that. And then, my dining room table. Okay, so listen, listen, listen. With the dining room table, I was like, because I was thinking of more group seating in my classroom, right? And I was thinking about buying something because I gave away some pieces. But I have to change my room up for it to be more group seating so i was like that table it is so heavy um i do like it but it's so heavy bye bye so i was like i could rent me a u-haul and put that right in my classroom but whatever i do i need to do it now and then in the meantime i could bring my little patio set that i'm thinking about selling my little patio set and put that right in the dining room Bring that inside, because I ain't using it. I ain't sitting out there rolling bugs. Bye. It's cute and everything, but I, I, I ain't doing that. So maybe I'll bring that table inside, and we can use that. Because it has a little fire pit and everything. I do like that. So maybe I'll put that in storage. Because I, I do like that. So I don't know. So it'll just be my bed. And I'm going to get a nice clothing rack, because my goal is to go to my storage once a week and I, do, I get my five outfits honey get my five outfits and I'm like 
I'm going to do it. Somebody was like, build as you go. You get your van, honey. You get your van and get a little mattress, an air mattress, sleep in that van. Just figure out some heat and figure out AC until I get it done. And then I was like, even if I have to live up in this car for a couple of months while I save some coin, I'm going to do it. I'm done. And then the owner, the garbage disposal, um, that went out. So the garbage disposal finally gave up. She's like, oh, that's a $75 repair fee. We're not going to raise your rent because you pay your rent on time. We just love you, how you upkeep the house and blah, blah, blah. I was like, okay, I, I'm tired of paying rent. I, 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 I'm tired. And like I said, I had a house. I lost it. So when you have a house... And if you have child support, you can, and I've talked about this before, but for my new babies, or if you forgot, because y'all know I talk a lot, um, when you have a house, you can use your child support as income. And this was all around the time that Harvey hit Texas and shut us down. I mean, for months, the destruction, it was terrible. I couldn't find a job. I was still relying on that um, child support. The child support stopped. And then when things started getting uh, going again, I, the child support never got going again. So I was relying on that child support. Like I was relying on air. But baby, it was a lesson learned. A lesson learned. Although, you know, child support, that was the dad's responsibility. But I will never, ever put myself in a situation where I'm relying on someone for my livelihood does that make sense mm -mm, never again it was a lesson a valuable lesson learned never again because if somebody wants to pick up or not pay rent bye 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 i'm still gonna be able to take care of mine so i will never do that again that was the worst feeling going through that process of losing my home and not knowing where i was what was gonna happen i i had no clue I, it was just terrible. It was terrible. So, baby, that's the one thing. You could turn my lights off. You could turn the water off. But, baby, I'm going to keep a roof over our heads. Okay? You should have got to pay the car note, too, because I got to get to work. But, I'm like, bye, bye. So, I'm like, I'm I'm just over it right now. Um, in the future, I may want to get a home, another home. But, right now, I just want that, that financial freedom where I can save I don't have all that overhead. Um, and where I'm going to start? I may start with the coffee mugs, honey. Nobody drinking coffee up in the house. I may put them in a bar. <laughs> Mom tell me to start in that garage is what I need to do. <laughs> but I was looking at the coffee mugs. I was like, we don't even use all these. Bye, bye, bye. So I'm going to start little by little. And I'm going I'm to I'm I'm share this journey while I start the planning process for converting to it could be car living van living whatever it is it may be in the back of this car mm -hmm. all i need is a toilet and they have those portable those really nice toilets i can get little things at a time period mm -hmm. i'm gonna do it y'all good bye 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 mm -mm. bye mm -mm. so what i'm gonna do i hate that i'm gonna bring well i'm gonna bring that table to school because then it still holds sentimental value. So my desk in my classroom is a tape, my very first table that I purchased. And that's so, I don't know, clean baby, I've 20, over 20 years. So I have that and this will be another table. So I bring a part of me inside the classroom and that'll be a good seating for, it could be two, four, it could be seating for eight people. That'd be a good group table. You see, you you feel me, you feel me? Okay, but with that particular table, I will need a U-Haul. Talking about heavy, baby, it's heavy like nobody's business. So, I'm gonna run this by Bobby and see what she thinks. So, and I'm gonna clean that um, little patio table, that patio set that I, I really do like it. And I'm gonna bring that right in the dining room area. Right, so the only thing I'm looking to bring to storage all my clothes, yes, my clothes, okay? Um, my clothes and my bed and my, you know, my cooking stuff, okay? So let me know. Let me know your thoughts in the, in the comment section below. I'm tired. All the rent prices have gone up skyrocketing when I was looking to downsize the, the house. For a two-bedroom, they wanted like $1,500, $1,600. I'm like, why would I get up and move now, move all the stuff to a smaller space and be paying the same amount? 
Miss Vesamia for one more year. But I will not, I refuse. And you hold me to that. Next August 2023, hold me to that. I will not be signing another lease. I refuse to do it. I'll be, I'm living a box on a corner. I'm not going to do it. I refuse to do it. Anyway, let me go in this library and try to get my life, get my thoughts sorted out. So I'll be here today and I'll be here tomorrow. I'm going to try to get here earlier tomorrow. So send me your ideas and your thoughts. Leave it in the comment section below. I just, bye, bye. And then somebody was like, well, what about the kids? What about the kids? What about them? Clint better figure it out. I think I got a spot on these glasses. Clint better figure it out. I don't know what he's going to do. You got to figure out. He'll be 21 next month. Sydney will be 18 in a couple of weeks. Then I'll have an 18-year-old, a 19-year-old, and a 20-year-old. And then in August, the next month, Clint will be 21. So it'll be 18, 19, 21. And then Bobby turns 20. And so it's all for one month, it's always consecutive. So anyway, just, um, oh, with the kids, I'm like, if I'm doing RV living, car living, van living, box living, whatever kind of living it is, but baby, I'll be saving money. First time in my life where I could just put, put a whole check away, put a check away, put a check away. You know, I'll still have a car note. I'll have the storage expense, but I, I could put a check away. I've never been able to do that ever. I've never had anyone take care of me where I could put a check away, you know, try to have a little savings. So I'm looking forward to that. So I can help the kids. And so with the savings, when they come home for holidays or something, we can vacation somewhere for a month that they're home. We can rent an Airbnb for the month that they're home. There are a lot of options. We don't have to have, you know, a home. And then while they're in school and stuff, what they come home for, for uh, Christmas, Thanksgiving, that's it really, spring break. We could go, go on a, a vacation. Stuff we haven't been able to do because I've always been on a struggle bus. Look, bye bye you know just, just have a plan in place and with me being able to s save a paycheck or two you know i have a few extra coin because honey <laughs> the coin is negative right now okay okay what about negative so i just i just want to have that that freedom so baby i'm excited i'm excited so i'm gonna write down these goals and when i need to accomplish them and the steps i need to take we can do this. We can do this. Okay. 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 I'm going to do it. Y'all Y'all know I've been talking about it for a minute. Guys, you just can't talk about it. Got to be about it. Ha! I'm going to do it, y'all. Oh, my leg shaking, y'all. I got the leg, my leg bouncing down. And my leg is bouncing. My leg is bouncing. Okay. All right. All right. Let me go into this library. <coughs> so leave your thoughts in the comment section below. I love you. Love you. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Kiss, kiss. You know, I got some lip gloss on here. Oh, yeah. So, I did. I was telling you, I went to the doctor. Okay, this is the last thing. Calm down. Calm down. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. So, I went to the doctor just to get, you know, see what. Oh, I did say that already. My iron is low. She said my cut. She said, watch your carbs and exercise, which I have not been doing. Okay. So, I'm going to build that into my schedule, too. Okay. 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 Mm -hmm. So, I'm trying to cut down on my carbs. So, I don't know, I'm having a steak tonight. Steak and some broccoli. How about that? And some mushrooms. I like mushrooms on my steak. And a whole bunch of onions and mushrooms. And Oh, that sounds good. That's what I'm going to eat. What y'all eating tonight? Leave it in the comment section below. Maybe I'll do me a little muck in the bong. Muck bong. Muck bong. Okay. I can tell I'm starting to act crazy. All right, let me get my tail in this library and get my life child. All right. Love you. Bye, y'all. Make sure you click like, click like, click like before you go. And share, 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 share. Ooh, child went to the dentist. Okay, for real. I went to the dentist. I got to have teeth pulled. Oh, my God. I tell you, my front teeth are the bomb. And if those who've been with me, not my back teeth like a nightmare. I got to have a, a few teeth pulled. I, I don't need dentures. Child, if they say something wrong with these front ones, I'm going to be dead. Dead. I'm going to need an antidepressant. Any and depressant. That's what I'm going to need. I'm going to need any and depressant. Some of my front, baby. Anti and depressant. I'm going right to the doctor. Uh-uh. Back ones be gone. But my front ones, you better stay right there. Sure, I've been wearing a retainer for years. All right. I'm, let me stop playing with y'all. Let me get my buddy here and try to sort this crazy brain of mine out. <laughs> All right, <laughs> make sure you click like, honey. Click like and share, okay? Bye, y'all.